Hey everybody, the Bonga's back. Welcome to part 18 of Let's Play Dynasty Warriors 4, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Okay, in terms of unlocking the Ananmon side, as well as Mongwo and Zhu Rong, I'm not even sure if I fulfilled those requirements. I've looked online, some people say you have to defeat Mongwo all seven times, beat them once in a duel each, finish the campaign, and then you're done. Other sources say you just have to defeat Mongwo in a duel once, and Zhurong once, finish the campaign, and then they're unlocked. I guess we'll find out as soon as we're done with this campaign if we unlock them or not. So that's neither here nor there, so let's go to the Battle of Yi Ling and finally take on Shu. Okay, and some people were wondering about uh, Huang Gai's last outfits. In fact, why don't we show them off right now? And it's these two over here. Now these look like his outfits in a uh, Dynasty Warriors 3. So you know what? I think this one looks cooler. Okay, so basically now we're in the Battle of Yi Ling, and here's our objective. Make sure Sun Jian doesn't get defeated, and then we have to defeat Liu Bei. Sounds easy, right? Well, if you look to the southwest, you see something called the Stone Sentinel Maze. You gotta go through there, unfortunately. I did some practice, didn't get any new items that'll benefit me in any way whatsoever. But let's see if my uh, elixir is still at level 1. I definitely would have replaced that. Tiger Amulet's still at level 5. Peacock Urn, I think, upgraded to level 18. And we're also gonna get Huang's Bow upgraded to level 11. So yeah, that's my equipment right now. I really want the elixir to upgrade so I can use my Muso more often. That being said, however, Much Games Guide's still at level 7, and defense is looking pretty good, so we'll stick him with spears, no pun intended. Alright, now let's take a look at the units we gotta deal with. Okay, we seem to have a pretty good team, all things considered. Liu Bei has a very good team as well, and he's got a lot of units. Wei Yan's gonna be a very big threat moving forward. Yue Ying, Zhuge Liang's wife, is also in the battle. Ma Liang, Ma Dai, Wang Zhang, and Wang Ping. Okay, so strangely, I did not see Zhuge Liang on the battlefield at all. He might make an appearance mid-battle, so be on the lookout for him later on, because he always has a plan. Okay, it's time to settle this in southern Jing province. We will use a fire attack to incinerate the Shu forces. Lu Shun will take command. Follow his orders exactly. Until the Shu forces charge out, we'll stay on guard. Okay, well, technically we, we are still gonna go up there and attack. Make sure the Shu, the Shu forces stay away from our base. Okay, Wei Yan is nearby, so we'll be on the lookout for him. We'll probably deal with Zhang Bao, too, who's also Zhang Fei's son. I don't know if it's biological son or adoptive son. Anyways, I find it weird he's also named Zhang Bao, even though we faced a Zhang Bao on the Yellow Turban forces. But it's not the same guy, of course. That being said, however, he's our opponent now. Nope, don't even think about it. Oh, good, we get an item. The more items, the better. Okay, so far so good. I mean, it's just a bunch of shoot forces. This is definitely a breather compared to the non-mod campaign. Then again, having your balls clamped by a friggin' car battery is not as bad as the non-mod campaign. Trust me on this one. There, this should keep my bodyguards well prepared. Okay, let's take a look at the units around us way on somewhere to the west. I'm heading there right now. Okay, nice bit of fighting going on inside this base. Alright, Wei on, let's dance. He's a tough guy. He's pretty fast, and he's got a very strong weapon. But I gotta clear out these troops around me. There we go. Oh, Guan Xing is somewhere around us as well. That's one of Guan Yu's sons. Speaking of Guan Yu, he's not even in this battle. In fact, in the storyline, the reason why there's a battle of Yi Ling is because Guan Yu got killed by Wu. Retreat. 
he's one for words that way on guy is. I think the reason he is this way is because he was born with another face on the back of his head. So it's a bit of a birth defect. Oh, Watchtower? Alright, I'll head there right now. The Watchtower should be somewhere north of the Stone Sentinel Maze. So in order to carry out this fire attack, we want to make sure the Watchtowers are out of the way. Otherwise, Yu Ron's going to be spotted. Except for you, Yue Ying. We might as well deal with her while she's pretty much in front of us. I really like the uh, music in the battle, Yi Ling. It's just very epic. It's too bad you don't hear it much more often after that. Who else is tagging us? Guan Swole? Yeah, another one of Guan Yu's sons. I must withdraw for now, my husband. Uh, I'm not your husband! Oh, great. Wang Zhang is here. Man, we're just gonna be constantly bombarded by troops. There, that takes care of Guan Suo. Get another item for that. That's great news for us. Oh, there's Wang Zhang. Oh, Bragg is gone. Who killed him? Huang Zhang? Okay, like Sha Ho Yuan, Huang Zhang has a very good ability when he uses his bow as a charge attack. Like, it's just extra power. So be very cautious against him if you battle him from a distance. Okay, I'm not doing good health wise. Damn it, I got interrupted. I hate interruptions, thank you! Gotcha! I may be out of arrows, but I still have a bow. Not gonna do you any good if you got no arrows! Bows are not really designed to be destructive unless you have arrows. Okay, now I can focus on going to the watchtowers. I don't think my bodyguards are going to live throughout this battle. They've already taken a thrashing from the other troops. Damn, they got a ton of watchtowers. So there's just going to be arrows everywhere. Okay, where is Juron going to be? Anyways, I should really take out these watchtowers over here. I don't know if it's these watchtowers or the one further north. Ah, crossbow troops you gotta deal with. It must be around here, actually. Yeah, we're gonna be shot at pretty much every single time. However, at least we can take out the watchtowers and just open up more ground. Ah, Dolby's gone. That sucks. Constantly losing bodyguards here. But again, it's much better than Nanmon campaign. A hundred times over, mind you. I don't want to go through that again. Oh, Cole, survive this. Okay, how many other watchtowers are there? Well, let me check out where Juron is. Remember, he's the guy in charge of the whole fire attack. Um... Where is he, anyway? I don't think he's supposed to show up. Let me check the history about the watchtowers. Oh, they're around here! I gotta go further to the right. That's where the task force is. Are we not too far out? Yeah, can you get a little closer, please? Ah, gross is gone. Okay, task force should be somewhere around here. Oh, there was more watchtowers. But let us proceed. Guard you runs you advance the target area. Set the fires as we plan. Okay. I just gotta make sure that Juron survives all these troops. 
It's being a one. Ping! There he is. I think my uh, extra power is gone, though. That sucks. I could have used it. Oh, we're fine, Lushun. Thomas might not be, though. Oh. There's an extra bit of attack power. I want it. It's Mord! Okay, Wong Ping's morale is dropping. I'm gonna make him drop altogether. Once I get a chance to attack him. Did I just put him right through the fence? That's a fun way to kill someone. Face them through matter. That's force. I found you skill. All right, there's still some crossbowmen that I gotta deal with. Man, they can fire pretty fast. Even when you kill one, there's still another. And they got very good aim. Okay, where's you, Ron? Still fighting. Better clear out those troops so we can just get to where he needs to go. I mean, you don't really have to pull off the fire attack, but it will give you good morale when you do. So it will be a good idea to execute that. Perfect. Now let's go. I think we gotta set it off around here to the west. So that's our designated point. It's gonna be a lot more troops and a lot more watchtowers, unfortunately. But we're ready for them. There. Should clear out these troops. Create an opening. Wonderful. Oh, there's still more of them. And they're ready for us. But we're ready for them, too. Oh. You gotta die, too. Sorry. Oh, wait. I'm not sorry at all. I'm one guy, bitch. Oh, there's Liu Bei. I'm starting to think that if I defeat Liu Bei here, I actually skip a lot of this level. I tend to have this battle a lot sooner. But this is a good way of doing it. Oh, but man, he's coming at us. He's going to have very good morale for this, so he's much tougher. I think I'm doing this the short way. Are we not too far out? Yeah, can you come here, please? Oh, we executed the fire attack. There we go. We succeeded. Oh, you're using a Muso attack on me. Oh, pulling back, eh? Don't even think about it. Oh, he, he escaped. So I guess we are going to do it the long way. That sounds like what I do for intercourse, but let's go! So I guess we do have to go through the stone settlement maze after all, because I did not finish off Liu Bei in time. He escaped into the... Spidey Castle. Take them off. That's the plan. Now we got a nice bit of morale. We have got him in, in hiding. I for so there's still the matter of actually going through the Stone Sentinel Maze to reach them. Farewell. Uh, looks like there's still some fighting going on near the base. So I should deal with that scrum, and then I'll go for the maze. So much for finishing this level faster than I thought. Ah, excellent work. It's one less stronghold to worry about. Speaking of which, we should take out another one. Where is he? Oh, 
right here. Perfect. Oh, my die is here. Okay. Deal with him, and then I'll go to the maze. Beautiful. And another item. If I can get that tiger amulet upgraded, or even the elixir upgraded, then I'm in good graces. Alright, the Wu forces should take care of what's left. Now I'll go into the maze. Okay, I'm not really a fan of Stone Sentinel Maze because you have to go on a set path. And the music gets kind of creepy when you go in there. Because, well, there is no music. What I should do, instead of taking the short path, take the long one. Like so. Go. This is very much the way you should go. It'll make it easier. Because whenever you go into a room, whatever door is up will go down, and whatever door was down will go up. So you gotta go in a set pattern to make sure that you're not just going around in circles. Luckily, you don't even get ambushed here. So it's really more of a puzzle rather than a scrum. And how did you guys get here? You're just running around for no reason. Okay, we're almost out of the maze. Good. Good thing I practiced this. There, we're out already. And then the music just restarts. So now it's just a matter of getting into Baidi Castle. Alright, Lube, I'm coming for ya. It's just a matter of going through this rough patch over here, and then we go north. Oh, there's Jugaliang. What, what is he doing? Okay, he created a waterway. So what is that supposed to do? Oh god, you know what this is? All forces, march around the stone sentinel maze. Oh, it was a trap! He's basically just waited for us to go through the maze so he can attack the main camp directly! Well, we're here! That scum! And now they're all heading this way. Oh, now Guan Yu is here. There's reinforcements from the southeast. Are those Guan Yu's forces? Yep. Luckily he's by himself. They're all heading for the main camp, so I better get there quickly. Alright, just one less troop to worry about. Of course he's not dead, but... I'll slow him down. Oh, that's not the way I want to go. So I might as well just take the same path they took to get here. Where's Soon John anyway? Is he okay? Ah, oh, he's over there. They're all converging on hit at his point. Shitty. Oh, full moose over for ten seconds. Yeah. Enjoy this while it lasts. There, now I'll just ignore you guys. Except for you scum. Now I just gotta stop Liu Bei before it's too late. I believe if you did not take on the non-territory first, then Guan Yu would not come. So yeah, doing that stage will give you a disadvantage. Not a very bad one. But still, that's just one extra threat. I mean, Guan Yu is just pretty much a sore loser. We got here before he did. That's his problem. 
There. He's done. Hmm. Should I take this horse? You know what? I will. This will allow me to get there faster. Oh, they're all in the main camp now. I don't know if one is there yet. Oh, great. So now it's going to come down to the wire. Luckily, soon John's not in any immediate danger. Mulan, am I worried about you? For some reason, it rhymes with Mulan. Oh, there's Liu Bei again. Oh, they're all at me. I didn't get much out of that, though. Crossbowman troops gotta go. Oh, Liu Bei didn't recover his health. Good. Oh, so I got three officers to worry about. Let's try to get some more ground covered. Oh, uh, thanks! Oh, give me more Muso power. The less troops to worry about, the better. Oh, deadlock! There. As soon as Blue Bay is defeated, we win. If I take out the other troops and I maybe get items about it, that's collateral. I want to at least win before Guan Yu heads our way. Oh, get the health. Get the health. Or launch me into the health. Thanks. Oh, they're not, Tai. They just got plenty more numbers than us. But we got the heart. Why is Mulan in yellow color? What happened? Oh, did I defeat Liu Bei? I didn't even swing at him. I cannot die here. Not before the Han is restored. Huh. He just got in the way, walked into my attack, and as a result, I win. Uh, okay. Thanks, Lube. You just gave me an easy victory. Man, a lot happened in that fight. Cavalry armor, don't want. Seven star sash, upgraded. Tiger amulet, still at level 5. Wing boots, horn helm. So it didn't really benefit me in any way. And of course, my bodyguards won't upgrade. Uh, I was hoping the Tiger Amulet would upgrade, but oh well. The Wu army succeeds in eliminating the threat in the south and achieve a decisive victory over Liu Bei at Yiling. The Shu army had, had suffered considerable damage and had no choice but to retreat to Chengdu. Riding the waves of momentum, the Wu forces advanced further west. Wu had finally reached the final battle. Once Luo Castle is taken, it is just a short distance between the forests of Mianzhu to Chengdu. Now is the time to defeat Liu Bei and bring glory to Wu and the Sun family. Alright, this is the final battle of the Wu campaign, so I'm going to stop the video here, and in the next episode, we take the fight to Shu once and for all. See you later everyone, thanks for watching.